What is up guys, here I am again with another unboxing slash first impressions video. I haven't done any of those videos in a long time but now I got the opportunity because I just got a package I was really excited about. And I'm pretty sure you guys know from the title down below that it is the House of Matriarch uh, Black Bird or Black Number One. To be honest with you guys, I'm not really familiar with that house. I only smell one, which is Coco Blanc, which is I have a decan of. I love it. I think it's great, and uh, it's on my to buy list. Even though it just doesn't last and doesn't project on me that long, but it's just phenomenal. This is a total blind buy. I don't know what to expect, guys. I know it's a leathery fragrance. I'm in a leathery kick this fall and I've been enjoying my leather-based fragrances and I just want to vest in my options. So hopefully this is a fragrance that I would enjoy and I would keep in my collection. Here's the box. I just came back home right now. I'm trying to do videos but I guess uh, that's a video <laughs> like, like that and now they have a note or thank you for your order enjoy bohemian black thelium blah 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 okay that's uh, kind of um, the receipt with the little note with it that's a nice touch oh, with the heart I just saw the heart right now that's uh that's nice the house of mystery arc I think that's a booklet. I'm gonna read that later. Oh, I think they got me uh, some samples, which is what I really looking for. Hopefully, they're Seattle Matriarch Bohemian Black. Okay, anything from that house is good. I want to try everything, to be honest. Uh, there's another one. This is uh, Trillium, Trillium, at least they're, uh, they're sprayers, so that's good, so, well, anything from that house, I'll take it, so, here's the bottle, let's see, if, is there anything else, another shiny uh, object, and that's it, that's pretty much it, so here's the, uh, the unboxing don't smell anything so let's uh here's the moment of truth okay let it waft a little bit that I already oh wow interesting this is I, I pick up the oud. I don't know if it does it have oud or not, but I really pick up a big right now from that first smell more than the leather. It's oudier. It's like oudy. Okay. It's oudy, woodsy. Then the leather in the background. It's different. It smells like it's green too. It's green. It's kind of like a piney green. Piney. It's like kind of like it reminds me of a Christmas tree, like a like a burnt Christmas tree. That's what it is. It's kind of like smoky burnt Christmas tree. That that's what I get out of it. I don't. I don't know. I smell like cardamom. It's kind of like cardamom is spicy. I don't know what does it have, but I, it's kind of like cardamom -y. Like It's got like cardamom and a piney, cardamom <laughs> I don't know, leathery, woodsy. It's, uh, it reminds me of that uh, fragrance of uh, Serge Lutens, in a way, it's not with that, the leather. I forgot what's the name of it. I have it right back there. A, uh, a uh, Fille en Aiguille by Serge Lutens. Fille en Aiguille is kind of like, smells like pie, like a burnt, like or smoky pine tree, kind of like Christmassy. That's what I get with that, with added leather into it. That's what I get of it. It's green, pretty much. It's so, so green, so 
woodsy, smoky leather with maybe it's got cardamom or something. It's gonna, it's got like a, some a spicy factor in it. Like card, I, I don't know. It smells like cardamom to me. That this is pretty much it. It smells really nice. I really like it a lot. There's a little bit of sweetness, which I didn't expect at all. I honestly, I expected this to be like raw, dark uh, leather, but it is. It is. It's. Uh, it is not. It is not. It's kind of. No, it's got some sweetness, it's got some uh, richness into it. Probably I, I could be off, totally off, but that's what I'm telling you guys, that's what I got out of this first impression. So this is pretty much it guys, uh, I hope you guys liked the video and you, I hope you guys liked the uh, first impressions and uh, please if you do so, give me those thumbs up, I always appreciate them and uh, see you guys uh, next video and uh, hope, I'm, I'm still working on, uh, not working, I have everything ready i just need to sit in front of the camera like this and just shoot my uh, summer uh, uh list and uh but uh, hopefully i'm just gonna do that probably uh tomorrow or after tomorrow if i don't jinx it and uh probably get another video at the end of this week see you guys soon peace what's going on people? and now let's start design i did my full niche list a few days ago so if you missed it links